5,000 in New Jersey. Big daily jump in positive coronavirus cases. Hospitalizations are also up. And here are the numbers for you. 5,673 cases now reported just today. There are currently more than 3,300 people in the hospital. Of those hospitalized, 600 of them are in the ICU. It is the highest percentage in six months, and nearly 400 of them are on ventilators. 48 people have died from the virus. CBS 2's Meg Baker has more. The outlook for the coming months is bleak. But I think we're in for a brutal two or three months. People have gone indoors. We're in the holiday season. Enormous pandemic fatigue. A lot of transmission in private settings. So no matter how good you are at enforcing your rules of the road, uh, we can't get into everybody's living room. New models show COVID-19 cases spiking in New Jersey now and staying very high through February, sending thousands into hospitals. Governor Murphy says behavior can change that future for better or worse. Stay away from each other if you wear your face masks, if you continue to have small holiday celebrations with your own family or the bubble with whom you're inside of which you're living, uh, and you don't travel, and if you don't feel well, you take yourself off the field and at the appropriate point get tested. Those are the basic things. Dr. Perry Halkidis with Rutgers School of Public Health says a vaccine priority plan is imperative to get this virus under control. First, healthcare workers, then what he calls frontline workers. People who work in restaurants and in big box stores and deliver our mail in some ways are at much greater risk. How should the state get the word out that it's necessary for everyone to get vaccinated? So vaccine hesitancy is nothing new in our society. Dr. Halkita says local health departments will need to work with community leaders to do boots on the ground soliciting and use someone like Elvis. Yes, Elvis. In 1956, Elvis Presley on TV took the soft vaccine, and that affected how people thought about the vaccination. So I want, mm, I want some stars like Taylor Swift, you know, King Kanye perhaps, and uh, Beyonce to come forward and take the vaccination live on TV and encourage especially young people to be vaccinated. Governor Murphy says the numbers Friday do not include those caused by Thanksgiving gatherings. Those cases are likely still in the incubation period, so expect another spike in the coming days. In New Jersey, Meg Baker, CBS 2 News.